Richard Pease, and uh, I, I was a lieutenant uh, when I left the Navy. I uh, entered the Navy after graduating from Ohio State. Uh, I uh, entered the Navy uh, uh, because I didn't particularly want to go into the Army. <laughs> it had to be a job. Uh, um, so I went to OCS. Uh, still have a, uh, a close friend as my roommate at OCS. Still see him occasionally. Uh, and uh, so when I left uh, OCS, uh, I was assigned to the USS Tripoli at LPH in San Diego. Um, I, uh, so I, I uh, went to San Diego. I remember um, spending my first night in the, in, uh, the BOQ at Coronado. And it, and it was the first time I'd ever seen the Pacific Ocean. And uh, it, was, it was a nice place <laughs> for a, uh, a, a Navy facility. So um, I, I uh, was the uh, di gu uh, gunnery division officer, the Fox division officer uh, for the Tripoli. Uh, did that for about almost two years. Um, qualified as an OD, uh, underway OD. Uh, really enjoyed that. Uh, I really loved the, uh, the ship handling uh, aspect of uh, being an OD and, and, and being in the Navy. And that was one of, the, one, of, one of the highlights I, I thought of my Navy career is being able to drive this uh, uh, small this LPH, this small helicopter carrier around. Uh, that, that was great. Well, you know, they broke you in slowly, obviously, you had a lot of training to do that, uh, so, uh, but you, uh, you know, yeah, you felt the, you know, while you were on the watch for four hours, uh, um, certainly felt a lot of responsibility and, and uh, um, it, you know, great experience for, you know, I was 22 or 3 years old uh, at the time and, and uh, you know, having that responsibility uh, was was unique. I, I thought, and uh, but it was very exciting. It, you know, I I really loved the the um, the physical part of uh, maneuvering a ship, uh, and uh, strange as it seems. You could you this big old LPH, uh, you know, 600 foot vessel, the flight deck 70 feet above the water. You you could fit you you felt it like you do a motorcycle. Yeah, so um, that was really uh, one of the highlights I thought of my career is being able to do that uh, and, and have that experience. Uh, driving that ship, uh, it, it was really, you know, really enjoyable, loved that, loved it. Um, had some friends from that uh, tour that uh, I remained uh, close to. Um, uh, then uh, we had made, um, I had made, I had just begun my third deployment uh, to uh, Westpac, uh, and we were we were carrying uh, Marines were there during the Tet Offensive of '68 up in from Da Nang to in Way and on up to the DMZ. Saw a lot of that uh, 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 activity. Uh, the ship carried the uh, I think it's CH-46 helicopters. Uh, and Marines in and out of the, the beaches uh, on all the various operations. So, talking about being an OD on, on the uh, Tripoli. Uh, of course, we were uh, off the coast of Vietnam all the time, and uh, one, of the, one of the things that I found uh, that, that, was, that was very memorable is uh, the New Jersey uh, would operate in the same area sometimes. I think it was down around or south of Da Nang. Uh, I saw them. but. Two or three times, uh, when you had a night 
you had the 48 or, or, uh, or midnight to 4 or 48, uh, you might see, uh, you saw a lot of op operations go on. You saw the A4s and Phantoms, you know, making their, doing bombing runs and things like that. But uh, seeing the New Jersey uh, and watching her do shore bomb at night uh, was pretty amazing. Uh, um, yeah, let's see what else was it? Oh, and, and, and the best thing about the 4 to 8 bridge watch was about, you know, you usually didn't have much sleep, so you're, you're tired, everything is black, uh, and uh, you're struggling to stay awake and and not hit anything with the ship, you know. And, but about 6 a.m., the cooks would have, would have started breakfast and they would send up the hot rolls to the bridge. And that was uh, the best part about a port eight. Yeah. Anyway, while, while uh, off the coast there of Vietnam, uh, uh, operating on the uh, Tripoli, um, I saw these little swift boats running around. Looked like a lot of fun. Uh, looked like more fun than what I was having on the LPH. So I volunteered for swift boats, asked to get that duty, and uh, lo and behold, I got it.